evaluate the following integrals we have integration of x to the fourth minus 3x squared plus 1 with respect to x so pretty much we need to use the power rule because we got all three polynomials and the integration is given by when we have x to the n antiderivative of x to the n is x n plus 1 4 plus 1 5 all over 5 minus for the second term same thing 3 survives times for x is square x 2 plus 1 3 over 3 plus antiderivative of 1 is just x and since the derivative of constant is always 0 we can always write plus c let's simplify we can write 1 fifth of x5 or this is fine x5 over 5 3 and 3 cancel minus x cubed plus x plus c final for part b we got again three terms and we know that antiderivative of ex is just ex because derivative of ex is ex plus antiderivative of sine and we know that antiderivative of let's say any constant x dx is negative cosine ax divided by this constant a antiderivative of sine is negative cosine ax if there is a number in front of x we need to divide this fraction by a so so we have in this case negative cosine 3x over 3 plus 1 over cosine is square there is no antiderivative of fraction so we need to get rid of this fraction first and we know that 1 over cosine that's the reciprocal of cosine is secant so this is same as secant square x now we know that antiderivative of secant is square because derivative of tangent is secant is square antiderivative of secant is square is just tangent so in this case plus this antiderivative of secant square is tangent x and plus c always there this is it maybe plus minus minus that's just one extra step minus one third cosine 3x plus tangent x plus c final